Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a screen capture and record your whole entire screen to make it into a video. Uh, this is used for making quick video tutorials and today we'll be using the program QuickTime Player. Uh, it's a new feature that they just built into QuickTime to uh, do screen recording. So let's go ahead and start QuickTime. Okay, now that it's started up here, you go to File, New Screen Recording, and you have some options here. Okay, so this little down arrow brings you your choices of microphones, and we'll use the uh, microphone that's built into the laptop, and then the quality of the video after you're done recording, and then where you want to save it to and uh, it's set to desktop so that's all good so then we're ready to record so I'm gonna make a quick tutorial on how to add and remove items on the dock so here we go just press record and some information here on st stopping to record you can either press this button that's up on top here or you can press command control escape on the keyboard so then let's just start recording okay today we're going to be doing a video tutorial on how to add and remove items on the dock here okay so to remove items it's fairly easy all you have to do is just click and drag the item off of the dock and you've now removed the icon from the dock. Okay, so I just removed Photoshop and Adobe Illustrator and let's say I want to remove iCal as well. So then to add items to the dock it's easy as well. You just open up your hard drive, go to applications, find the items that you want and I want to replace the ones I removed so I'm gonna open up Photoshop. Now the tricky part is that you gotta make sure you hold down on the uh, button because you don't want to let it go if you're on the desktop here because if you do you'll move the uh, program file onto the desktop and you don't want that you want to make a shortcut onto the dock so here you can choose any spot on the dock to drop it and I'm gonna drop it with all my other Adobe products. Okay, so I'll go back out and I'll open up Illustrator and I'll drag that right next to it. Okay, and also my iCal. Put that back. Okay, and so that's it. That is uh, adding and removing items to the dock. Now these folders here can also add folders by clicking this whole entire folder here let's say for example I wanted my Dropbox folder I can just drop that and then when you click on it all of my items in that folder is here okay so at the end of your video tutorial and typically you don't want to start talking um, after your video tutorial uh, you can hit stop here or you can hit the the uh, command buttons the keyboard shortcuts so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit stop and now we're gonna have a little this is a preview of the video I just recorded and I can just play the video start recording Okay, today we're going to be doing a video tutorial on how to add and remove items on the dock here. Okay, so to remove items, it's fairly easy. All you have. Okay, so uh, that's pretty much it. Um, you can bring this video file that you see here that's on the desktop. You can bring this into iMovie and you can do some editing if you'd like. Uh, to chop uh, some of the 
parts in the beginning and some of the parts at the end and that's pretty much it and here's your video file that's ready to upload to pretty much any site like YouTube or whatever or just to playback for a presentation alright so I hope that helps good luck